global clean energy transition is moving fast and faster than many people realize. For five decades, the IEA has been setting the global agenda for energy policy and technology. The agency is a trusted resource for credible analysis. The Net Zero by 2050 report continues to be an important roadmap towards achieving this critical goal. I'm excited about the mitigation and adaptation technologies that are emerging, but we're still in the early stages. We need to drive innovation and ensure that breakthrough technologies are not only discovered, but also developed and deployed. Your efforts make a huge difference to those of us who are trying to drive climate progress, whether it means making investment decisions, drafting policy, or reporting on the changes taking place. Our net zero roadmap shows 35% of all emission reductions needed to reach net zero by 2050 must come from technologies that are still in development today. Green energy has the power to enhance and enrich lives. We are delighted with the innovations that have gone forth in this PV solar industry, and it is poised to be our next clean energy development frontier. We need equally drastic innovations, development, and revamping of the transmission grid infrastructure to enable safe integration and deployment. Collaborative efforts between IEA and governments in development of policies and strategies in energy access, green manufacturing, and just transition all work together towards greener economies sooner than later and a sustainable future for generations to come. We need to pay attention to adapting technology portfolios to local conditions around the world and ensure that we invest in the energy infrastructure that will enable rapid adoption. International collaboration to support technology development and transfer and dialogue on just how to do that are essential for a successful rollout of clean energy technology at a global scale. There are a lot of bright spots of hope for technology innovation all over the world. In India as well, we are seeing a strong innovation culture brewing with many new startups emerging in all sectors, including some really high risk ones. We need to catalyze more innovations to scale and create impact globally. Technology collaboration has been part of the IEA's DNA ever since the organization was founded five decades ago. Soon after its launch, the IEA created an unprecedented legal structure for international collaboration to accelerate more efficient energy technologies. The technology collaboration programs are an important part of the IEA community. Today, they involve more than 6,000 experts from 55 countries representing 300 institutions worldwide from both public and private organizations. They work together to advance the research, development, and commercialization of almost the full breadth of cleaner energy technologies. Technology collaboration programs have resulted in raising knowledge and understanding of clean energy technologies for decades, directed it to new inventions and demonstration projects, to new databases and standards. The technology collaboration programs have also contributed to the IEA's work on tracking new and emerging clean energy technologies. But more can be done on international cooperation on technology innovation. There are many stakeholders involved, from uh, academia to research labs, from corporates to startups, from investors to philanthropy. New ways of international cooperation require all these stakeholders to communicate with each other effectively and with governments. We, as the IEA, stand ready to work with all stakeholders to accelerate clean energy technology innovation, which is vital to the rapid global energy transitions needed to keep climate goals within reach.